Hey, Leafs Nation. Welcome back to our channel for another exciting update on everything Toronto Maple Leafs. I'm thrilled to have you here as we delve into the latest news surrounding our team. So, let's jump right in. In a heartwarming moment at practice on Monday, Kaye Jarncroc received a warm welcome from teammate William Nylander as he stepped back onto the ice. Jarncroc, who's been sidelined since March 14th due to a hand injury, showed promising signs as he participated in parts of the team's practice session. Maple Leafs head coach Sheldon Keefe highlighted Jarncroc's progress, stating that while he's not quite ready for game action, it's encouraging to see him gradually increasing his involvement with the team. Unfortunately, with the regular season rapidly winding down and no full practice session scheduled until after Wednesday's game against the Tampa Bay Lightning, Jarncroc's return before playoffs seems unlikely. But before we continue, if you're enjoying this update and want more Maple Leafs content delivered straight to your feed, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell. And hey, if you're liking what you're hearing so far, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps us out. Jarncroc's potential activation for the remaining regular season games presents a challenge for the Leafs. With Bobby McMahon and Max Domi already sidelined, the team faces a shortage of available players. While Jarncroc's return would bolster the lineup, the logistical hurdles of managing the salary cap and roster space add another layer of complexity. Keefe remains focused on managing the team's dynamics amidst these challenges, emphasizing the adaptability and resilience of the players. With the postseason looming, the priority is ensuring the team is primed and ready for the challenges ahead. And remember, Leafs Nation, we want to hear from you. Drop a comment below with your thoughts on Jarncroc's potential return and how you think it could impact the team.